Hi there, and welcome to the CCI Learning Jasper Active How To video series. My name is Lee, and I will be assisting you in using our amazing hands on Microsoft Office learning program, Jasper Active. In this video, we will be guiding you on how to create a group in Jasper Active. So, you've already created your teacher account. Great! The next thing you need to do now is to create a group. By creating a group, you will be able to view your students' progress and generate reports. In Jasper Active, a group is made up of students linked to a specific class and teacher, like yourself. Each member in the group uses the same group key to link to the group. Once they are linked to the group, students can begin working in their courses. To create your group, firstly, log into your Jasper Active teacher account at www.jasperactive.com. Next, click on the Groups Manager option in the Teacher panel to view the Groups Manager page. Now, click on the red Add New Group button at the top right. A new window opens and displays the General Information tab. Let's have a look at the fields before you fill them out. Don't fill in the Group Key field. A Group Key will be automatically generated once your group is created. The Group Key is the code that will link students to your group and allow them access to the courses. Enter a name for your group. You're welcome to name it whatever is suitable for you to describe your class. For example, business class Wednesday AM. The license purchased by your school will appear in the current licenses drop down menu here. Select the license you have been authorized to use for your group. If you are using a center license, as we are in this video, you need to enter a start date and finish date in the fields that appear. You may then select the courses you want to make available to your group. Click an application suite tab and select the desired courses. Click save to create the group and generate the group key. Next, forward the group key to all of your students of your class. Tell them they can use the group key as an activation code when they create their student account. If you are providing the group key to students who have already created their accounts and activated their courses, these students will need to manually link to your group. This will be covered in a separate video. Next, click cancel to return to the main groups manager page. Lastly, to verify the creation of the new group, and to list all groups associated with your teacher account, click the search button without entering any search criteria. To view or edit a group's information, locate the row for the group you want to access and in the options column, click the pencil icon. To delete a group, locate the row for the group you want to delete and in the options column, click the delete icon. This concludes this short how-to video. Thanks for watching and we will see you on the next one.